Clark was my first character in a film, and it was given to me by Harold Ramis. And we worked a long time on that script, uh, about a year. And, you know, I didn't really quite know how to play him, but Harold just did it for me, and, you know, just on the first day of shooting. And I just immediately fell into him, and I could see what it was. It's a very optimistic, uh, kind of uh, mediocre guy uh, who uh, would like to think he's better than that. And, uh, but he's loving and, uh, you know, it just, it just became easy for me, and I think he's really a character that I can fall right into. Fletch was much more uh, me. Uh, uh, there isn't an ounce of cynicism in, uh, in Clark Griswold, uh, whereas Fletch was all, you know, sarcasm and cynicism. And, uh, so he, I, I'm very close to that character, and I love doing it again. It's just great, a lot of fun. I can't think of anything more fun to do at this time I, than to get back into this character. I feel it. I feel like I just fell right back into character easily. There's something about the optimism in them that uh, is relatable. Uh, you know, re regardless of everything going wrong that can go wrong, we're going to get to Wally World, and that's that's where everything's going to go right. Of course, it doesn't, but. Uh, that's, uh, that's what it was all about. This is the kind of father everybody would want to have, I, I would think. You know, he's, he's always up, he's always ready to go, he's always, you know, there's only, he just has a, a breaking point in each, each of the films where he goes bats. Uh, but uh, he's understood and, you know, you got to let, let it out every so often. I love uh, Ed Helms's takes on uh, Rusty and uh, how much he's like Clark in many ways. Um, although there, of course, is nobody like Clark, but um, uh, which is going to be clear when we see the picture. He's still a nut. <laughs>